I've laid out here quite a few different items that uh, I deem very useful in bopper smithing. Uh, some of the weapons that you, or some of the materials that you're going to use in building foam weapons for dagger here legal weapons are going to be blue foam purchased at Walmart, yoga mat purchased at uh, Dick's Sporting Goods. Uh, you'll have your stadium foam camp seat, which is also purchased at uh, Dick's Sporting Goods. That will be used later for a stabbing tip. Athletic tape we have. We have DAP, Gorilla Glue. You need something to be able to cut your core. Hacksaw, just a little mini cheap hacksaw. Sharpies, other useful tools. This is a carpet knife. I use this for some other detailed cuts. This right here is my pride and joy, which is something that not many people know about. This is one of the greatest tools that I've come up with. This is a 10 inch drywall taping knife that I have taken and used a Smith's draw sharpener and sharpened the edge so it's nice and sharp and gives a great cut. We'll go over this later. Other items that are useful will be sandpaper. If you have too much rough edges, you're going to want to sand it out. Gorilla tape, duct tape works just fine. This right here is extreme packing tape or extreme strapping tape. You can tell it has the cross hatched uh, fibers in it, very strong. I wouldn't use anything less. Good tape measure, and the best thing ever that goes along with this taping knife is a nice straight edge. You want to have a very nice weapon, this is the way to do it. If not, not exactly necessary. You can eyeball it if you want, just won't be pretty. 